Hi, this is Sheena and uh, welcome again to the tutorial on basic crochet stitches. So last time we spoke about uh, the material that you would require to begin your crochet project and I said that we have different uh, sizes of needles available and the sizes are mentioned on the needles themselves so you don't get confused. Um, so if you're, oh, today we're going to talk about how to basically start. So you want to start with your, your starting loop, all right? And the way you can do it is to um, form like an X around your finger, at least this is how I do it. I'm using a 4mm hook in this case, needle in this case. And what I like to do is slip the needle under the first, this part of the X, and then draw up the other side of the X and then it forms a loop like that, right? And this is uh, an adjustable loop as you would see. So I'm going to show that to you again. You form an X, um, put your needle under the thread, the first one side of the X, draw up the other side and you form a loop like so, okay? Uh, the other important thing is how you wrap your yarn around your finger. A lot of people I know like to just roll it around uh, their forefinger like this and um, keep winding it as they go. So you can try out whatever works best for you, but the way I like to do it is to wrap it around my little finger and then another round um, around the forefinger. And by doing this, it gives you a little more flexibility in the sense that you don't have to keep uh, rolling and unrolling. So this works out to a very smooth flow of yarn, right? Um, so that's how you start your you, uh, loop and, and wrap the, ra the yarn around your finger. And then we will see how we um, start up with the stitches in the next tutorial. Thank you.